Hello and welcome to the lesson. Today we're going to do a tune called The Pinch of Snuff. Um, it's a great Irish reel and good news, there are nine parts in this one. Um, so you're going to be busy for the rest of the evening. Um, so the first two parts are in D. The second two parts are, are exactly the same two parts, only in the key of G. And then we move those up to the key of A. And then we move up to D. And then we have one more part at the end as the cherry on the cake. So, without further ado, here we go. The first bit starts on an F. Try that again. So it starts on F sharp, two fingers in the D string. One more time, slow down a wee bit. Okay, the next phrase is. So it's kind of similar again. I'll try it one more time. Got two zero two one two three one. And the next phrase. So similar to the first one, only the last note changes. The last note's an F sharp. Okay, so let's try those three together. Three, four. Last phrase of that, break, of that part is Hi and welcome to the advanced lesson of Pinch of Snuff um, Hopefully you get on okay with the, all nine parts of that one And uh, now we'll have a look at something we can add into this um, The handy thing about it is the, Generally the things that we add in to the, the D key or the G key or whatever Is going to be the same um, in, in every other key that we play th through this tune um, Hopefully you've, you've now understood the, the whole uh, Key of D, then moves to the key of G, then moves to the key of A, then back to D, uh, only on the higher end of things, and then we have one more part in the key of D at the end. Um, so, let's see what we can do. Um, again, I'd like to emphasize the key of each part. Um, so, for example, in the first part, the key, the, the D is the most important note here. Um, so, emphasizing every sort of a opportunity that we can, we can get to emphasize the D, um, go for it. So, for example, the first bit... That whole phrase you can you can uh, double stop with the A. So all your melodies happen on the D string. So if we want to play the A string together with that, uh, it'll sound like this. Okay, you don't have to do the whole phrase like that. You can break it up and you can do it twice or you can take a space in the middle. You can lean back and forward over your A string. Um, to double stop as you as you wish. Um, the next phrase is something similar. 